So I was in here eating my dry cereal because I, I I literally don't have any milk. <laughs> please, someone send me some milk, please. Bonnie, Bonnie, please. So Bonnie is back. We got a main game update, major quality of life changes. Now, you know, I don't know exactly how big this update is going to be. I mean, worst case scenario, we just play the game again. But apparently they made some like pretty big changes to the game that make the game better to play. But what I'm most interested in is the adjusted endings part. There are a few differences in some of the endings as we were updating the game. Can you find them? Oh, well, Bonnie, it is so nice to see you again. Oh, man. Okay, it's all reset. All right. Well, let's, let's see. Hopefully, hopefully a few endings have been updated. All right, we're going to skip that tutorial. Oh, my God. So, like, they, they made a change to... So, apparently, you can just, like, skip things. I could just choose not to, like... Oh, my God, there's a menu. Oh, so when you... Oh, okay, that's cool. So when you go here, you have a trash can now. I can just throw all the food away. It's still called whites. So you can just go to, like, this. Oh. Oh, it's so amazing. Red velvet, white donuts, pastry, meat bun. Put my dry cereal on there. Oh, so now, so if I want to make my meat bun, and remember, I could put it here. Wow. You see, back in my day, we used to not have these menus. <laughs> <laughs> we had to do everything by hand. I'm literally combining everything inside here. I'm like losing all my poor customers. Wait, I actually did make something. I didn't even mean to, to be honest. Bonnie has decided that she quits. She doesn't want to work here anymore. Yes, we got the bingus ending. Okay, well, this one obviously has not been changed. <laughs> okay, what's the meat bun? <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna pull it up. Where's my me button? Oh my god, you can click now? You just click? Oh, this is so amazing. I, I hated the dragging parts. Okay, okay, wow. Put the meat there, cut the meat up, mix that, put that on there. Ah, that is much nicer. That is much, much nicer. Because I every time I play this game, I forget how to play it. Oh my god. So what happens if I only serve one customer? I only serve one customer. I did something, but I'm still a piece of crap. All done. Ah, rough dated, huh? <laughs> yeah, I literally didn't even do anything. That's okay, we all make mistakes sometimes. Hey, on the plus side, you can save on ingredient costs <laughs> and customers. I won't have any customers. I guess I'm still getting the hang of things. I'm glad you opened the bakery. It's nice to have a place to relax and take my mind off of things. Did the bear always talk like this? Does the bear know? I never knew we lived in such a dangerous neighborhood. It's so scary. Oh, no, this definitely did happen. Now I remember. Uh. Look at her. Uh. Uh. You know what you're doing, Bonnie. You know what you're doing. She's even kind of sweating a little bit. Ooh. It's definitely been scary. Stay safe out there, bear. The gall. The gall that Bonnie has. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, it's time to get some fresh ingredients. Well, I wish I had some milk. Can you give me some of that, Bonnie? What's up, Bonnie? What's up? I'm coming. I'm coming behind you. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. <laughs> I don't know why I thought this would be. <laughs> I don't know why I thought this would be a good idea. Okay. Well, we have one of the endings right here. Bonnie sweeps the floor and dusts the windows. Today is going to be another big day. Customers are already making a line outside of her bakery. She opens the door and they all scamper in. She looks at the crowd with a warm smile. I'm surprised she got any customers after like 50 bad reviews that she probably just got from not serving anybody. A regular customer pops out of the crowd and gives Bonnie a friendly pat on the back. Hey, Bonnie, old friend, since you can't really give me on the recipe to your cake, how about you make one for me to take home? A cake for you to take home? Hmm, I've never thought of doing takeouts before. That sounds like a good idea. Yes, Bear, I'll bake you a red velvet cake to take home. And you know what? Since you're my number one customer, I'll use my freshest ingredients to make that cake. I don't think I'd notice any difference yet. Oh my god, I just realized it's a face. What the heck? If you go to the options, I'm still chewing. This this bowl of cereal is taking me so long to eat. It's like, yeah, I could have waited, but I don't care. I love what they did with the pause menu. They made it all like, oh, I'm scared and the escape is still like how you leave. Wait, how come I can't talk to him? Oh god, I'm like, oh god, I'm so sorry, Panda. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Um, why can't I pick anything up? That's why it's not working. I am pressing E. Is my E broken? All right, I just had it. So my E, <laughs> my E definitely works. All right, great news. I found a way to play the game where it's not uh, messed up, but I'm sure they will update it. Oh my God, I finally did it. 
<laughs> that took me so long, man. I, I, I'm so bad at this game. And I had bad luck as well, which doesn't help. You escape from Bonnie's Bakery, finally free from that horrifying place. Nothing can erase those uh, terrible smells and screams from your memories. Nothing. You gotta tell the townsfolk about Bonnie's crimes, and as you dashed away, you ran with such fear and vigor that she felt to notice that the notes you had collected were slipping away into the wind. Oh, that's... That, I think this one is new. Bonnie watched you carefully from with her bakery as you sprinted away too quickly for her to give chase. Oh, but she knows. She can have a sign posted up in her bakery with us. After an annoyingly slow day, Bonnie had swiftly taken care of the rest of her ingredients. She always felt better with the clean basement, after all. She disappeared quickly into the cellar. So she erased everything, cleaned it up, and, and there's no evidence. Yeah, this is totally new. To finish the job and clear her mind. You, on the other hand, would not have as much luck finding peace. I don't know. That doesn't sound like something Bonnie would do. Yeah, this is a prank or something? You're seriously saying this stuff again? This is the last straw. The townsfolk ignore your plea. No one believes you, and some even call you a liar. Ever since that day, you live in fear and paranoia. You live alone now, far away from the cursed town. But even though you've already uh, thrown your old life away, you always have an aching suspicion that someone is watching you. We know Bonnie's watching us. Yeah, all right, all right. I like the changes, if, if I'm not mistaken, that is. All right, I did it. I played perfectly. I did the code. I want to see if the final ending has been changed. It's been so long since you escaped from that hellish place. What you've seen, what you've heard, it all haunts you. You want to show the townsfolk who Bonnie truly is, but you don't have any evidence that can impact her shining reputation. That day, you failed to notice that the notes you had collected were scattered in the wind as you ran away in fear. We keep losing our notes! You could try to break into that bakery and steal enough evidence to convince the townsfolk, but you doubt that Bonnie would let that happen so easily. Okay, yeah, this isn't the true ending. I, I forgot you have to do the secret code, but especially since she knows that someone has escaped. You now live it within the most hidden place of the town, keeping an eye on that monster. You know that the best way to get evidence is by catching her in the act of gathering ingredients. You grip your camera tightly, waiting for the moment she strikes. Three of five, waiting. Yeah, I can't exactly remember uh, if it's been changed, but... Okay, what what is ending two? I totally forgot. Okay, I finally got all the endings. So, <laughs> I got confused. I was like, how do you get ending number two? To get ending number two, you have to, like, miss one? It was really confusing. You have to get the slow and steady. So you can't be too fast, but it's like not clear how fast you need to be. Either way, I got it. So let's see if this one's uh, changed. You escaped from Bonnie's Bakery finally, free from the horrifying place. Nothing could erase the terrible smells. Nothing. You grip those notes you collected tightly in your hands. You could use this. They were precious. So this time we're not gonna lose the notes. That's the difference. Bonnie, after rather a successful day at the bakery, hummed to herself. Since she had a, such a good haul today, she decided to take it easy on tomorrow's prep work. You go to tell the townsfolk about Bonnie's crimes. At first, they are unwilling to listen to you, but then you reveal the notes. Ah, the damning evidence that helps you escape in the first place. The townsfolk were shocked to hear your tell. Some were in denial, while the others trembled in fear. How could it be the food they had been eating all this time is... As the townsfolk drew closer to the bakery, Bonnie realized she was done for. With no time to clean, she instead made a hasty escape. The mob surrounded the bakery, de uh, demanding Bonnie to reveal herself. They broke down the door, and their eyes scanned the interior with bated breaths. They searched the bakery from head to toe, but found no one. Only the evidence of her crimes had remained. Bonnie was gone and never seen again. Yeah, I can't remember exactly everything that's been changed. Maybe you guys can point it out. Alright, now that we got all the endings, I have the secret code right here. I just have to go put it in, and there's nothing Bonnie can do about it. And it is 51322. Oh yeah, that's right, we get the knife, I forgot, alright. I wanna see if this one has been changed. Die, Bonnie! Don't we, like, carry the panda on her back? I can't remember. Oh, <laughs> you grab the limbless bear with you as you finally open the door. The smell of must and blood wafts throughout the bakery from the cursed room. Thank you, muttered the bear weakly. 
The townsfolk were shocked to hear your tale. Some of them were in denial, while the others trembled in fear. How could it be the food that they had been eating all this time? The townsfolk escort you with the injured bear to a hospital. You sigh relieved that this is all finally over. As the injured bear finally slumbers comfortably, you look outside of the window to see a gathering of townsfolk. A large group is going to investigate Bonnie's bakery to see the aftermath of everything. Secret in free. Oh. Okay, well, I don't think that one has actually been changed at all. <laughs> Wait, what is the knife? Does that- it just shows you the cutscene again? Oh, the ingredients are running low. What the heck? All right. Looks like it's time for- What is this? What? <laughs> is she transforming? Body transforms into the vegan teacher. <laughs> what buddy to make an appearance? All right, time to head out. I've got a few potential ingredients here on my list. It's hard being so popular after all. So many people have their eyes on me. I can feel them watching me. Constant watching. I understand how they feel. They're jealous because the bakery's been doing so well. But you can't be following me around like that, silly ingredients. Now, who to pick? What is this? Bonnie's Bakery DLC coming soon. What? Oh, so we got it. So we did get a secret ending, kind of. This is crazy. <laughs> it just shows how insane Bonnie actually is. She's like, oh, I'm so popular because they're jealous of my successful bakery. So she puts on a bunny mask. Now, who to pick? Okay, well, I'm really interested to see what the DLC is going to be about. It sounds like freaking Bonnie has truly gone off the deep end. Well, we knew that already. But that's really interesting. All right, well, I'm glad I, I'm glad that there was something a little extra in this, uh, and I'm glad that I decided to play it. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you want to see my initial reaction to the game, check it out, and check out other horror games that I've played on the channel. Be sure to subscribe, that way you don't miss out on when we play Bonnie's Bakery. And yeah, I will uh, link the download down below. But that's, that's going to be it today, guys. Bye!